today we're gonna meet up with someone he's an onboard w2 rider from penang too so he's gonna come here and we're gonna ride around here and probably to pantai pasir panjang which is 20 kilometer Salam. Yeah, sir. Chapi, chapi. 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 So from this moment, I'll just comment on top what we're doing because I don't have time to like talk to the camera because we'll be riding quite fast. And here is just a cruise at the paddy field, make sure that you avoid all potholes. And now we're back on the main road. We're going to the beach and we have to use the main road, there's no other roads, but be careful. Like here in the traffic line, make sure that you accelerate very smoothly, otherwise you'll be thrown back. And right now I'm using my direct drive electric skateboard that uses these big wheels. This wheel is very comfortable and absorb much road vibrations, maybe around 70% less road vibrations on this wheel, so it's very comfortable. And here is just onboard W2 speeding at a nice and smooth road. So make sure that you stay by the side. So this is the speed bump I mentioned in my right safe video. Make sure that if you see this speed bump, you have to be very very slow and ride over it very slowly because you will get thrown off. And right now we're just stopping by to buy sata and rope to bring to the beach. And here is the uphill part to the beach. We'll see the onboard W2 performance. But he's just using mode 2 and he's actually pretty heavy, around 100 kg or more. So the performance on the W2 is very very good, especially on the battery performance. So as you can see we are speeding up hill, speeding on the flat road and using everything we got and we can actually go back and he have like 20% left. And now it's just carving downhill. It's very comfortable on his onboard W2, very very smooth road. And here's another very fast downhill. Make sure that you be careful on what speed you're riding. If you're not comfortable with high speed, then lower your speed down by braking a little bit early. Don't like to try and force your limits. So like me, I am at a safe speed because I don't want to go fast with this setup. This double kingpin setup is not meant for high speed or otherwise it will be very wobbly. So I keep my speed on the low side and just go down slowly and we just rest by the beach around like 15 minutes just having some talk and we are back on the road again And we are back on the main road again. So we're just gonna use the same road that we come from. And as you can see, it started raining already. As you can see, our board is soaking wet. And the road is very wet, so it's very slippery. Make sure that you be careful on riding on slippery road. If you can, just avoid it at all costs. So we're just gonna ride back because our board is supposed to be water resistant. So the rain just got heavier and heavier but we're not gonna stop because we're like 3 kilometers away so we're just gonna ride till the end. As you can see we are soaking wet, our body is wet so we're just gonna ride slowly back to the place that we started. So when riding on wet slippery road make sure that you just go straight do not try to make turns otherwise you will skip. We're like 1 kilometer away hopefully our body is fine. So definitely do not try this even your bot have a water resistant rating. And we are about to arrive here. 